Welcome to our channel. Today we bring you the 10 most incredible new luxury electric SUVs coming in 2023 to 2024. Before we continue, please press the subscribe button and the bell notification icon to receive regular updates whenever we upload a video. Luxury manufacturers are following the trend in releasing new models that blend design, performance, and sustainability as interest in electric vehicles continues to rise. In this video, we will showcase some of the most impressive new luxury electric SUVs scheduled to be on sale in 2023 and 2024. These cars are made to appeal to buyers who want the newest electric powertrains, high-end amenities, and cutting-edge technology. As a result, these cars provide remarkable performance, range, and design that are guaranteed to draw attention on the road, even if they are expected to cost more than many other electric SUVs. However, it's crucial to remember that when more information becomes available, specifics regarding the release dates, prices, and features of these prospective models may change. 10. 2024 Audi A6 e-tron A prototype of the following electric member of the Audi A6 family has recently been cited. The A6 e-tron is the electric version, which Audi initially teased in 2021 with a barely covert concept version. Earlier this year, the carmaker followed up the initial idea with an A6 Avant e-tron concept, clearly suggesting the A6 e-tron will be offered in both sedan and wagon body types. Avant is Audi's designation for wagons. The production A6 e-tron is scheduled to be on sale in 2023, which means it will probably do so as a 2024 model. It will face up against high-end variants of the Tesla Model S hatchback and the Mercedes-Benz EQE sedan. The Q6 e-tron and A6 e-tron are two of the initial automobiles to be built on the VW Group's PPE modular EV platform, which Audi and Porsche principally created. The electric Macan, whose debut has also been postponed until 2024, will be the first Porsche to use the platform. 9. 2024 Buick Electra E5 The Electra E5 will be Buick's first electric vehicle when it goes on the market in late 2024. We know it will be created in China for the Chinese domestic market. However, it is still being determined if the North American version will be produced locally or imported from Asia. Suppose the Electra follows the Buick brand's existing small structure, which is still uncertain at this stage. In that case, the basic model will likely be the preferred trim, with the mid-range Essence adding more luxurious features and the top-of-the-line Avenir packing the most goods and the highest price tag. Photos of the Chinese market E5 show that Buick developed an attractive interior for its first EV car, and the materials also appear high quality. Up to five people may fit in two rows of seats, and the interior ambient lighting has many colors so drivers can alter the mood. 8. 2024 Cadillac Celeste Week Although the Celeste Week will be produced as a brand new model for Cadillac's 2024 portfolio, look for something other than the showroom floor of your neighborhood dealer. Celeste Weeks will be specially ordered, customizing to meet the needs of each buyer, and most likely supplied in the same covert manner as they are bought. Production of Celeste Week, pronounced Celeste Week, will consequently need to be constrained. As the Celeste Weeks appear at future Pebble Beach Concours delegates, we anticipate specific customers to design Celeste Weeks that draw attention both now and in the future, since Cadillac claims there's practically no limit to modification capabilities. 7. 2023 Faraday Future FF91 since the FF91's first introduction in 2017, Faraday Future has struggled to get the crossover on the road. In July, the firm said it would once again need to delay deliveries as it sought additional funding. However, with the official EPA range rating for its electric crossover, the California-based carmaker is one step closer to getting the FF91 into customers' hands. The FF91 has a 381-mile range rating and is currently expected to go on sale for the 2023 or 2024 model year. This is more than the previous Faraday Future estimate of 378 miles. Still, the firm also informed us that the range statistic was obtained using a 142-kilowatt-hour battery, as opposed to the FF91's earlier claim that it used a 130-kilowatt-hour battery. 6. 2023 Genesis Electrified GV70 The Electrified GV70 is a brand new nameplate for the Genesis series that will be on sale in the middle of 2023. 
As one might anticipate, the electrified GV70 costs far more than the gasoline-powered version. Still, the EV model skips the essential and select versions of the standard GV70 in favor of the advanced and prestige trim models. That means it's well-equipped right from the get-go, with standard amenities like a digital gauge display, leather upholstery, 20-inch wheels, a panoramic sunroof, and a wireless smartphone charging pad, among other stuff. The electrified GV70 will come standard with all-wheel drive, accomplished by two motors, one on each axle. A maximum of 483 horsepower is stated. According to Genesis, the electric GV70 will have a 4.5 second 0 to 60 mph time, making it the quickest model of the small SUV. We tested the standard 2022 GV70 and reached 60 mph in 4.9 seconds with the optional twin turbocharged V6. 5. 2023 BMW iX For 2023, a high-performance M60 model will be added to the catalog. It will have an all-electric drivetrain with 610 horsepower and a 290-mile range. It has an air suspension that adjusts for driving dynamically. Some places have combined the elements of convenience, dynamic handling, and luxury packages into one massive collection of characteristics and marketed it as the ultimate package. Above the X-Drive 50 level, the potent M60 variant fetches a substantial premium. There are two distinct iX models available. The first is the X-Drive 50, which comes standard with all-wheel drive and is powered by two electric motors that together provide 516 horsepower. The iX X-Drive 50 accelerated to 60 mph in our tests in under 4.0 seconds. With its staggering 610 horsepower, the high-performance M60 model can propel the mid-size SUV to 60 mph in only 3.2 seconds. 4. 2023 Cadillac Lyric In addition to being a new moniker for the American luxury manufacturer, Lyric is Cadillac's first all-electric model. It's designed to compete with powerful vehicles like the Tesla Model X, Jaguar I-Pace, and Audi e-tron. The favorable starting price of $59,990 for the Lyric applies to the single-motor debut edition variant with fewer options. Because that model is now out of stock, we suggest investing in the 500 HP dual-motor AWD model instead, which also has a 3,500-pound towing capability. Rear-wheel drive and a 340-horsepower electric powertrain are standard on the Lyric. In this basic configuration, the Lyric accelerates adequately and feels quick. Still, it lacks the sense of power we get from competitive SUVs like the BMW iX and the Model X. The rear-wheel drive Lyric reached 60 mph on our test track in 5.7 seconds, which is relatively speedy by mid-size SUV standards, but slower than that of EV competitors. Optional all-wheel drive with a 500 HP dual-motor engine adds a second motor to operate the front wheels. Although the model has not yet been driven, we anticipate its more thrilling acceleration. 3. 2023 Audi Q4 e-tron The 40 variants with rear-wheel drive will be added to the Q4 e-tron portfolio in 2023. These less expensive models use a lone, rear-mounted 201-horsepower electric motor. The 40s use the same 77-kilowatt-hour battery pack as the 50 models, but their range is more significant at 265 miles per charge as opposed to 236 for the 50s more potent all-wheel drive. The basic premium and mid-range premium plus trims have the entry-level 40 power plant, which is absent from the Sportback. One 201 HP electric motor drives the rear wheels of the base Q4 e-tron 40 models. Although we haven't had an opportunity to test drive the Q4 e-tron with this combination, we weren't too thrilled with it in the mechanically comparable Volkswagen ID.4. The all-wheel drive Q4 e-tron 50 and Q4 e-tron Sportback 50 variants produce 295 horsepower with an electric motor driving each axle. A purported 0 to 60 time of 6.2 seconds is the outcome. Though still slower than the Audi Q5 SUV with a gasoline engine, it is far more pleasant than the 40's estimated 7.9 seconds 0 to 60 time. 2. 2023 Canoe Lifestyle Vehicle all-wheel drive, AWD, and rear-wheel drive, RWD, with twin and rear electric motor configurations will be options for the 2023 Canoe. 
The canoe has a maximum dual motor output of 600 horsepower and 550 pound-feet of torque and a full rear wheel production of 300 horsepower and 332 pound-feet. The canoe's driving range falls well below that of comparable electric vehicles. It has an estimated 200-mile driving range with its 80 kilowatt-hour battery pack. Its distinctive design is one of the best features of the 2023 Canoe. In the upcoming months and years, Canoe will be an automaker to keep an eye on. It is an electric vehicle company with headquarters in Southern California and Chinese funding. Also, Canoe's founders have experience working with BMW and Faraday Future. The Canoe pickup truck's distinctive look is only one of its enticing qualities. Subscription-based business model, valuable features, and myriad customizability options. 1. 2023 Lagonda All-Terrain According to the business, the Lagonda Vision concept sedan that debuted at the last auto show was more of a hypothetical plaything than an actual production reality. We're informed that the external appearance of the first Lagonda EVs to go into production, a premium crossover that will be on sale in 2022, is quite similar to that of this year's All-Terrain concept. The decision by Aston to limit Lagonda to electric vehicles has relieved the company's designers of the burden of finding room for one of Aston's powerful engines in the front end. The SUV will be constructed at Aston's new St. Athens facility in Wales with the upcoming DBX crossover on the company's latest electrified platform. As previously stated, it will have an all-wheel drive and an underbody battery pack. Thanks for watching the video. Comment down below which part you like the most, or click on the thumbs up button if you like the video.